Instagram always has the fun apps. Are uh, do you do you pull up the hyperlapse anymore, Chilla? Um, very rarely. I, I need to find some. Like I need to have. I, I have potential sometimes use cases for it, but it's it's not something that I use daily, weekly, or I could even say monthly. Well, we've had the 15 second videos, we've had the 30 second Twitters, we've had the second second vines. How about your one second videos for Instagram? And and I thought this was an April Fool's joke. I had to check the calendar when I read this headline. But yeah, Instagram just launched a new app that loops one second videos. So we we can play with this a little bit. It's called Boomerang. And what it does is it actually will take a little bit of a video and then loop it back and forth. We talked about uh, what the GIF, the GIF toaster did a couple weeks ago. It reminds me a lot of that, to be quite honest. And, and I think one of the things that's important about this is, if I'm if I'm not mistaken, it does go back and forth, mm -hmm. so like a boomerang, right? right? So it goes forward and backwards which I'm guessing then it has to strip off the audio because I'm guessing you don't want to listen oh, to I don't the think audio, audio on this first. Thing. So, I, so that's where I, I really wonder, is it, are we that much better off with this versus something like the gift toaster? So I have it queued up here uh, on my app so you guys can see. Uh, so let's, let's see what we can do here. Hi, I'm getting a liked photo. So I'm on here and we're going to go ahead and record. Wait, how, how do I do it? Just hit this. Oh, okay. I did it too quick. I didn't really do anything interested. Interesting. So, uh, so it saved that. And <laughs> let's try this again. I'll actually, do something interesting. Like try to like w raise your hand and wave in the one second, or do a thumbs up or how something. How about that? How about that? There you go. There you go. And we'll go ahead and Instagram that, and boom, there you go. That is our boomerang. Oh, jeez. <laughs> so here, here's where I think one second is on the edge of too short. Um, personally, I like more of the... So I, I think this was kind of a, hey, let's try to mimic what Apple's doing with the live photo a little bit. Um, and the live photo is obviously simultaneously taking a still and grabbing a second and a half, second and a half video from the front and a second and a half video from the back um, and kind of assembling that into a video with audio. Um, I'm not sure how, how many people are going to pause when they're scrolling through their timeline to watch one of these for in the long run it's a cool gimmick for the oh, next couple of weeks. I don't think they're going to because isn't it an autoplay? Right. But I mean, so when I would see something moving typically on a timeline, I would, if I scrolled too fast to buy it, I would go back up to, mm -hmm. to look back at it. Um, I think this will grab your attention for, for a couple of weeks. And I, I think it'll quickly kind of fade off. It'd be a little goofy. I, I, I can't see any longstanding applications for this. Who knows? I mean, just just there's something to catch your eye, or maybe something for um, a very inventive, eye-catching sponsor posts, perhaps. Uh, Rotating Coke can. Right. Exactly. Um. <laughs> exactly. It kind of creates a creates a basis for that, I guess. Right. Uh, and 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 again, I think it. I think you're right. It does kind of connect with the idea of the live photos. It is that little bit of like, hey, there's a little bit of motion there. Uh, so I mean, it's. Uh, I don't know. Like, like, like the, the examples are shown in the video are like a dog moving towards you, you know? So, you know, I'll just kind of play with this a little bit. I'm kind of like working with motions just to kind of see what happens. Like, not so it would be kind of cool is if, you, if you could take, take the, and figure out how you can get a video into there versus like the record, like doing a live recording. And could you get an awesome cast still with the logo quickly flipping in the corner? Or, or something like that to, to bring some additional content to a still versus, I, I'm, I'm, like I said, I'm not sure how much this is going to keep, keep its momentum going forward. I, I, like I said, I think a second is just a, a tad too short. Right, right. I, and I don't think people can think in, in that short. I think we finally found our limit. 
<laughs> of how, <laughs> how short we can make our videos. Although I'm kind of like this like half 3D thing going on. I wish I went a little wider with it. But uh, we can have a lot of fun with that. I don't know. If you guys are playing with Boomerang, please uh, share what you're kind of making out of it. Uh, mm -hmm. if, you, if you're finding any interesting ideas or find somebody who's, who is doing something compelling with it. But this is, I, I think this is, you know, like Facebook, they're throwing a lot at the wall just to see what sticks. And, and you never know. Like, you know, you know, Meerkat wasn't supposed to be the success. It was just the second or third thing that group tried and it took off. So they paused, right? And uh, mm -hmm. I, I think this is something similar with this. And they're just trying to give you so many ways to uh, be interesting be interesting on uh, be interesting on on Instagram without just adding all this cruft to the app itself, much like Facebook, right? How Facebook has split everything out at this point. So, um, but no, I thought that was interesting. 